Good day, passion friend. This is Jen, and I'm here with one of the candidates of Great Man of the Universe Philippines 2022. I'm here with Apple. Hi, Apple. Hello, Sir Jay. Hello. It's nice to see you in person, Apple. Yeah, thank you. And it's nice meeting you too, Sir. You're okay. welcome. And uh, of course, um, uh, I believe uh, kakagaling mulang din sa biyahe all the way from Leyte. So, how was your travel? Well, the travel is quite long. I not really long, but I'm tiring at the same time because um, actually I am with um, Great Man of the Universe, um, Taklavan, and also with my regional director, Ms. Ronan Reverso. And yeah, it's quite fun to be here in Manila. How old are you, Apple? I'm 20 years old. 20 years old. When did you start to join uh, the pageants? I joined pageant when I was um, grade 5. That's my first pageant. Mm -hmm. well, I don't want to mention um, the pageant that I, since I am a candidate of Great Man of the Universe and I am promoting Great Man of the Universe in the organization. And that's the, and the last time I joined again the pageant is um, last 2021, sir. Mm -hmm. So I think that's um, one of the... Uh, one of, um, great opportunity for me to showcase again my talent, my skills, and how I am um, compassionate in this pageantry. You have mentioned about talents and skills. So, what talents do you have? Well, uh, actually, I am a sports enthusiast. Um, mm -hmm. I don't have really the talent, but you know what? Talent can be enhanced, mm -hmm. and uh, that's what really matters the most. All right. Uh, would you mind if you could share to us? Well, actually, um, if you watch my um, sports education video, mm -hmm. when I was um, grade four to five, I joined a um, baseball competition, and mm -hmm. we uh, we will be um, provincial. And, and when I was grade six, I played basketball also to compete, and uh, we get into congressional meet. And until this time, po. Um, nagagamit ko pa rin siya sa mga liga, tournaments, and intramurals namin sa schools. And then, when I was grade 7, I played badminton. Uh -huh. Grade 8 and 10, I played um, soccer with my friends. Kasi um, my classmate po, isa, isa sa classmate ko nag-transfer uh -huh. so from different school. Then me naman, as a sports enthusiast, and I want to learn so much as sports. So I joined po. Then that's the time na parang nagkaroon ng barakadahan. Uh -huh. And yeah, it's so much, um, I have so much fun joining those um, sports. Then when I was grade 11 naman, I learned how to play table tennis. And until now, yeah, actually I played um, um, table tennis mm -hmm. um, before I go here in Manila mm -hmm. with our Kobe Olympics post at school. Mm -hmm. So basically I won naman second place. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so that's a great um, opportunity then. And then, in grade 12 naman ako, varsity player po ng basketball. So, yun, but uh, fun fact lang about me is I don't know how to swim. I don't know how to Bakit? I don't know. Kasi di ba, ano, we, um, kapag sinabi natin na you came from late, eh, um, given na yun na yes, po. marunong ka talagang ano. Magsing. But when I was a child, po, takot mm -hmm. talaga ako sa dagat nun. Uh -huh. like, yung tita ko, ano, kinakarga ako, tapos uh -huh. pinupunta ako sa dagat. <laughs> Babalik ako, tapos iiyak. Yun, so parang tatakata ko. Pero now po, hindi naman. Sa swimming pool naman, ginagamit ko naman yung height ko. <laughs> so parang yung height ko yung ano, naging um, lakas ng loob kong bata <laughs> sa swimming pool. Alright, so you mentioned from being a uh, sports enthusiast and now joining the national pageant. So how was your transition? Well, this is, transition naman po is very easy because I have that um, confidence po and uh -huh. I'm very um, passionate po in what I'm doing and also mayroon din po ako mga motivation na nasa likod ko uh -huh. well, kaya po um, I'm here for sa pageant po. Uh -huh. uh, and uh, ayun, di ba nag-join ka na ng mga other pageants? So, so far may nananalo. Nananalo naman or minsan yes, natatalo ganun. Um, I joined the first in grade 5. Uh -huh. I get the crown. Mm -hmm. Then the first pageant po again in 2021, I won the crown again. And yung, the next pageant is um, first runner up. Then mm -hmm. the next one is um, I get the crown again. Then I think five pageants. Five. Then 
four crowns and one first runner up. Wow. But it's uh, mga school pageants lang po. It's mga school pageants. Yes, so, first time to join the national pageant? Um, yes po. I mean, actually, yung isa po is the national pageant, but online lang kasi siya. Ah, so, so, it's not really that um, uh, um, competitive, I think. Mm. Uh, it's nah, really quite um, challenging for you. Through, so, kasi it's a pandemic that time. Mm. And now, so you have mentioned that uh, you joined uh, the online uh, pageant. And today is a uh, face-to-face pageant. So what's mm. uh, what's the difference between two? Uh, I think the, the difference po is you get to know the people. Mm-hmm. Kung sino yung mga kalaban mo, kung sino yung um, nasa organization talaga, you met them face-to-face, mm-hmm. makakausap mo sila, you'll enjoy with them po. And I think that would be really fun po, um, being with them. Ayan, okay. And, uh, uh, Paul, uh, I'm just curious about your name. So, ano, ano ba, uh, may, saan ba ito kinuha okay. yung Apple? Okay, the story behind my name po is, um, my mom po is an OFW. Uh-huh. Then, parang may binabantayan siyang alaga dun. Which is name, uh, I mean, the name, pag tina-translate sa English is Apple. Uh-huh. So, parang, inst- parang in a joke way lang na sinabi ng mami ko na Apple na lang ipapangalan uh-huh. sa akin ng daddy, kay daddy. Uh-huh. Then, parang nasyak na lang si mami na yun talaga yung pinangalan. Oh. <laughs> so, parang yun, wala na silang choice. Then, after yun, nung chinek nila yung, ano, yung birth certificate ko, nakalagay pa dun female actually. Uh-huh. <laughs> so, parang hinabol nila, sabi nila, male, uh-huh. hindi female. Kasi nga, you know guys, diba? Um, Apple is a feminine name talaga. And before then, I have a story to tell na I'm really shy talaga telling uh-huh. my name. Like, in, in a tra- introduction, like, in, a sco- in school, uh-huh. sabi ko, nakakaya talaga super. Kasi nga, hindi pa ako confident kung ano yung, hindi ko pa accept yung pangalan ko. Kasi nga, it's a feminine name. Pero as, as time goes by, um, yun po. Parang nasasanay na din. Nasasanay na din. And now, yes, I'm very, very proud po sa name ko. And it's a unique name po, Rabbi, like me. Um, did you experience also bullying uh, with regards to your name? Kasi yes. di ba, usually, um, pag mga elementaries and high schools, dyan talaga ang, ano, ang talamak na bullying yes. pagdating sa mga names and also sa surnames. Yes po, super. So how did you, ano, how did you cope well, up? Uh, eh di, ano lang po, parang pinapabayan ko lang mm. po sila. Well, actually, it's true naman. Mm. Then, you just need acceptance lang talaga para mas ma, ano mo sila, para, para mas matanggap mo sila. Yan. Acceptance lang talaga. Yun naman eh, kahit, kahit naman anong pagbabaton sila, nila sa'yo ng mga um, bully, mm. kasi uh, may, meron din time na titigil at titigil yung mga yan. Mm. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. Anong height mo, Apol? I'm a, I'm standing 5 foot 10 po. 5 foot 10? Wow, yes. isang ka din. And, uh, ayun, what was your reaction nung sinabihan ka ng national director mo na you will be representing Leyte province sa Great Man of the Universe? Um, ako po, ano, I feel excited po talaga mm-hmm. kasi it is my dream po to be on a national stage po. Mm-hmm. And nakikita ko rin kasi yung mga inspiration ko like um, Kuya Tyron, the Mr. Globe, um, and then Kuya Michael Fred, kumaling din po. Kasi we're one of the um, management po. And actually yung si Ate Gaba siya. Mm-hmm. So parang sila yung mga um, inspiration ko and parang motivation ko para mas um, pag-igihan pa yung pageant siya. Mm-hmm. And uh, we believe that malapit na yung great man of the universe Philippines and I guess few days ago magpa finals na and starting tomorrow the activities will ano um magi start na din so my question for you is how was your preparation for this great man of the universe Philippines um, my preparation for over this simple po yung katawan natin mm-hmm. is siguro it's an edge pero for me po it's not an edge mm-hmm. it's just a requirement for standard and pageantry but we need to cope up with that and also um, with my communication skill I'm still practicing on that and then the pasarela mm-hmm. and then pampaingay sa social media kasi yun naman talaga kasi if you exactly. want to win you need a lot of pasapok exactly. and also ano parang totality na din yun as a great natin okay so 
how important for you is the social media, especially when you, uh, especially you are joining uh, the national pageant, uh, which is the great one of the Universe Philippines 2022. Well, for me, po, the importance of social media is um, very, very important. Well, because it's about promoting myself, promoting the organization, and also showcasing what I get. Po. And social media then is one of um, um, great um, communication po towards people kung paano ka makipag-interact, mm -hmm. kung paano mo sila um, um, kukunin in just um, social media videos, mga bagay for mga promotions po. Alright, thank you so much, Apple. And, uh, okay, so let's, I have uh, 10 questions prepared for you. And uh, this question is not just a pageant question. So it's more on getting to know more about your personality. Okay, first question is, how do you relax um, after a stressful day? Well, to be honest with you, I relax through eating talaga. Mm -hmm. Through eating, and then after that, syempre, as a sports enthusiast, after I eat a lot, then I played a lot. <laughs> I'm just curious about, you eat a lot, and then your body is not so, you know. Kasi nga po, ang sinasabahin ka naman siya ng ano, sports activities. Wow, ah, I see. Alright, so again, next question. What have you done uh, that you're most proud of? Um, maybe when I see my mom be proud of me. Because mm -hmm. um, I am a consistent, um, not to brag, um, I'm a consistent honor student when I was um, elementary, mm -hmm. um, senior high school, and also high school. And until now, I'm a dance list po. Um, to tell you, I'm a valedictorian when I was in grade 6. Mm -hmm. Also in my senior high years, I'm also a valedictorian. I think you know, just to make my mom happy, my dad happy. Think, you know, wow. happy. And uh, I forgot to, to ask you, um, what do you do prior of joining the uh, great one of the Universe Philippines? I'm currently studying po mm -hmm. at Eastern Visayas State University. Um, based on accountancy, um, third year student. Po. Wow, accountancy. So, kung sa naman yung ano yung course na yan? <laughs> oh, like super mahirap po. Kasi when I was in your high school, mm -hmm. I am a general academic um, student. I am a gas student po. So, parang yung transition po niya is very diff uh, very difficult po. Lalo na na nung nag first year ako is pandemic pa that time. Mm -hmm. So, parang I need to study well, study, study. Kasi nga, mm -hmm. wala namang teacher na nag-guide sa'yo. Although, mayroon naman online classes but it's not enough po. So, you need to watch some YouTube videos, mm -hmm. um, read some books po. So, pero now, um, medyo nag-struggle pa rin naman mm -hmm. but keep on fighting pa rin and learning pa rin. What are the, ta the challenges you have encountered? That um, first one is the lack of resources. Mm -hmm. So I don't know what to do at first. Like, uh, you don't have classmates besides you to help you mm -hmm. that time. Kasi nga, online class. And it's so nakakahiya naman if I chat. Oh, it's not that nakakahiya. Pero syempre, hindi naman, hindi nyo naman kilala yung isa isa. Mm -hmm. So, parang, it's uh, on na lang din na na dapat ikaw yung uh, magsikap for yourself. Alright. Okay, next question. Who is your favorite person to follow on Instagram? I'm not really into Instagram po, but my favorite person to follow um, on Instagram is my sister. Mm -hmm. yeah. Why? Why? Because I see the struggle talaga sa kanya. Mm -hmm. Kasi my sister is a very um, emotional person. Like, when she get heartbreaks, mm -hmm. um, lalapit siya sa akin, kuya, mm -hmm. we break up, tapos na, na umiiyak siya. Mm -hmm. Then ako din parang nas, mas naging emotional din ako. Siyempre kapatid ko, nasasaktan ko. Now there's also one time na um, nasaktan ko yung kapatid ko, na may sinabi ako sa salita sa kanya, then, uh, mm -hmm. then umiyak siya, umiyak. Tapos parang sinugod siya dun sa hospital that time. Mm, nakasalanan ko. Kasi dito sa umiiyak din ako. Tapos pagbalik niya, hilag ko siya. Tapos sorry, sorry. So, parang right now, um, I'm actually monitoring my sister. And also, she's a good student. One year student, and now, tapo na ata siya sa, wow. ano, yes. She's a nursing, nursing po. Nursing, nursing. 
Nice, pa pinagmanahan mo pala. <laughs> Alright, sige, next question tayo. Would you rather own dogs or cats for the rest of your life? Ah, um, dogs po. Dogs. dogs. Uh, siguro, we don't have that um, mayayamanin na dogs mm-hmm. like Husky and then, mm-hmm. or Golden Retriever like that. Or Shih Tzu. Opo, wala kami yan. <laughs> so, ano lang? More on? Parang more than Aspins lang. Aspins. Aspins. Kasi nga, yung environment kasi na mm-hmm. is not that good po para sa mga dogs na yun. And um, it really painful, painful po sa akin if I see dogs na mamamatay lang because mm-hmm. their environment is hindi angkop sa kanila. So much better if we ano lang sa mga dogs na aspins na kayo yung environment ng lugar na kami. Pero well, so far naman, okay naman yung lagay namin. It's not just ano, um, hindi bagay doon yung mga dogs na yun. Mm-hmm. Pero I like, I like cats din naman. Oo. Uh-huh. Pero yung bakit pili naman. Mas prefer mo lang talaga yung dogs. dogs. All right. So again, next question. What do you think is your best physical feature? I don't know. Some say it's mm-hmm. nose. Some say it's lips. Oh, so yun 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 dalawang yun. Ah, oh, sa lips oh, may jo pansinin din. <laughs> okay. So again, next. Uh, give three words you would use to describe your yourself. Um, passionate. Uh, mm-hmm. Um, compassion, mm-hmm. <laughs> lovable, something like that. Then, um, a jolly person. All right. And fun to be with. <laughs> okay. So if you could get one gift, what would it be? Um, siguro if, ano, yung kaya mabasa yung mga utak ng tao. Hmm. Uh, kasi, um, no one kasi will understand the situation ng mga tao. So, I rather um, have me to read minds po para for me to be able to help them kung syempre, di ba, lalo na yun yung pinaka worst na cases is mental health illness. So, one of this is depression, anxiety. So, I think that's the way for me to help those people po. Para mas matulungan ko sila on how uh, they, be, they will be able to overcome it. Alright, sige. If you had the day off uh, with nothing to do, how would you spend it? Hmm. Well, I spend it lang. Actually, po kasi taong bahay kasi. Ito taong bahay. I don't like parties. Uh-huh. Like, I never go parties po. Like, disco. I never drink. Like, I'm fa- I'm, I'm really happy naman po being at home. So, more on, ano lang din ako? Um, sports. Sports, then gala-gala lang. Uh-huh. And then, good trip. Good trip. Good trip. Good trip. Anong favorite food mo? Anything. <laughs> Anything basta masarap. Oh, hindi naman ako ma-artist. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Sige, sige, Apple. Thank you so much, Apple. And before we end this interview, of course, I will give you the floor to promote yourself, um, especially uh, for the great man of the universe, Philippines 2022. Hello, everyone. I'm Apple Lau. I'm representing great man of the universe, Lady Province. And also, guys, please support great man of the universe, their F- FB page. Instagram at Gateman of the Universe Official, um, YouTube channel Gateman of the Universe, and also don't forget to like those videos, guys, na andun sa YouTube channel. And also, guys, please follow me on my social media accounts on Facebook, Apple Pinto and Matalao, um, on Instagram, Apple, then, and also sa Kumu, guys, Gateman underscore Apple. And uh, don't care. Don't hesitate, guys, to DM me if you if you want to say something to me. Thank you. Thank you so much, Apple, and best of luck on your journey to Great Man of the Universe Philippines 2022. Ayan. So don't forget, guys, thank to guys. support Apple on his journey. And ayan. Thank you. Thank you. Bye bye.